What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, cat to side, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so much. Um, thanks for all the love and support to the channel. Thanks for all the likes, subscribe, shares. Thanks for all the sharing of, especially the sharing of my content on social media and word of mouth. Because it really helps get my content around to people do, that do not know about my business and my channel. So I really appreciate it. Okay, so we're going to do a reading. 5.48 a.m., 11.30, 2022. Hope everybody's doing well. Okay, so the channel message I received was, um, okay, so I recently got up like five minutes ago. I was in there um, getting me something to drink and just chillaxing, and I got the channeling, so um, I figured I'd come in here and do it. I've got something um, important today to do, so um, I figured I'd start my day off early, but then I got a channeling, so we're going to do it. Hope everybody's doing well. Okay, so the channel message I received was, someone that has already left like a thief in the night, they lied to you, they... Um, they said they were going um, a specific place, but they were not. That's the first situation. The second situation, I heard someone has been lying to you, and they're about to leave like a thief in the night. Um, and I, oh, sorry. Somebody doesn't want me to speak. Somebody has been lying to you. Um, they're about to leave like a thief in the night. I heard out of your home, out of your home, um, I heard they are secretly miserable. Um, for one of you, um, I heard they're about to move in with your friend. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Um, and for one, they say, they've been saying they've been working late and they have not. And for one, they say and they've been working late and they have not. So. You plug it in, how it resonates. Okay, so there's two different scenarios in here. This is our past energy. It's already happened. This is uh, about to happen, it sounds like. Well, some of it has already happened. Some has not. But you plug it in, how it resonates. So this one has already happened. This person's already left like a thief in the night. They left quickly, soon and quickly, gone, like gone girl, gone, gone, gone girl, gone guy energy. Um, but they lied to you. They told you they were going one specific area, place, what have you, what have you, what have you. It was out of your home. It was out of your home. It was out of your home. So they left out of your home unexpectedly, quickly, gone girl, gone guy energy. Um, they said they were going one specific place, but they were not. Uh, they did not. They went another place. And it's about to go badly for them. They think it's going to go good for them. Okay. And I heard it's about to go badly for them. They think it's going to go good for them, but it's about to go badly for them. This is situation one. This has already happened. They live in your home, it sounds like, and they left very quickly, just out of the damn blue. Boom, gone. Um, I heard it's going to go badly for them. They don't think it's going to, but it is. So how that resonates and applies. So situation one already happened. Situation two, they haven't left out of your home yet. But they're about to. I heard they're miserable. They're miserable and they're about to leave. For one of you guys, they live with you. I think you're in a romantic relationship with them or they're sleep or you're sleeping with them or something, some kind of sexual romantic connection. Because I heard one of them, they're gonna move in with your friend. And that's gonna cause a lot of conflict. And that's gonna cause a lot of conflict. So the one where they're gonna move in with your friend, where they haven't left like a thief in the night yet, where they haven't left just out of the damn blue out of your home yet, it's going to cause a lot of conflict uh, because they're going to move in with your friend. Um, and for one, they live with you. I heard they've been working. They claim they've been working late, but they haven't. They've been going somewhere else, but they're about to leave out of your home too. Wow. <laughs> what is, I mean, I've been picking up a lot of fast movement occurring in the collective. A lot of fast, fast, fast movement. I mean, this is definite fast movement, but this is just up and just damn leave. I mean, this is these are lies. This is deception. This is um, just up and fucking leaving. Like, I don't know, man. I'm a planner. 
I'm a planner, so it is what it is. I mean, <laughs> let me see if I hear anything else. The one that's already left, like a thief in the night, they have lied to you. They withheld information from you. They're about to ever regret it because they are about to get seriously lied to. Seriously and seriously used. Okay, so for this situation, the one that's already happened, it sounds like. Gone girl, gone girl, gone girl, gone guy energy, just up like a thief in the night, already left. Lied to you, said they were going one place. It sounds like they moved out of your house just quick. Um, they said they were going one place, but they didn't. They went another place, but they strategically withheld information and lied to you for that reason. I heard they thought it was going to it's gonna go good, but it's not. But they're about to regret lying to you, withholding information from you because um, they're about to get seriously used and lied to. Um, so the energy they display to you is about to come back on them, basically, for the one that's already, it's already happened. Now, there's some that hasn't have uh, hasn't happened yet out of your house yet. All these are in people's homes. So they live with you if this resonates for you. Well, this one doesn't live with you anymore, but it sounds like they just recently left. So this one, these, they do. But people saying they're working late, they're really not. People, um, but they're going somewhere else and they don't want you to know where they're going. Um, and um, the other one. So you plug it in, how it resonates. This is. That's why you should always be, just be damn straight. And that's just the truth, man. Be fucking honest. Be fucking honest if anybody needs to hear that. I mean, yeah, the truth might hurt, but at least it's honesty. Someone was gossiping that you were very, very, very impulsive in the past, very impulsive, but they're about to get a huge wake up call about real impulse about what real impulsivity is. Someone was really, really, really gossiping in the past that you were very impulsive. So impulsive means you just do things off the fly, you just up and do it. Um whatever what it I mean like you do things quick, fast, maybe without thinking impulsive um i'll google definition impulsive um that's my take on impulsive but we'll google definition it but i heard they're about to uh, have a perspective change um and a change of mindset basically because they're about to realize what true impulsivity really is so they gossiped about you in the past and and said uh you were very impulsive and blasey 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 in the past but they're about to get a wake-up call about what true impulsivity really is and it sounds like it's these people, but these people, damn, I mean, you're just up and just fucking like, either, it, I feel these people are like no notice, no notice or barely even notice, any notice. Um, damn. Why can't, you know, it's 2022. I know people, they're scam, spam, fraud, liars, thieves. We've got the whole gambit out there these, uh, these days, but Whatever happened to truth, honesty, and integrity? You might need to hear that. Impulsive definition. Acting or done without foresaw, forethought. Acting on impulse. So impulsivity means acting on impulse. So doing things without thinking, without forethought, without um, thinking it through. Somebody really gossiped about you in the past and said that you basically acted without forethought, foresight, um, acted on impulse. But they're about to realize that you really wasn't impulsive, not near to who they're experiencing now, basically, or has experienced. I am. And a reader was in cahoots with another person 
to, to, to strategically move into someone's house to case information on them and it's about to seriously backfire on them. Many clientele of this reader is about to, communication is about to go out like wildfire to many clientele of this reader. Updating them on the story of this reader was behind this person to get it, the case to get in their home and case their home and to find out information on them. It's about to cause this reader's business to go down in a huge way. Was trying to be a secret sleuth. Huh? What the hell? This is so psycho, man. This is so fucking psycho. <laughs> So we have a reader out in the universe. Online public platform. Online public platform. Online public platform reader. It can be masculine or femme reader. They basically worked in cahoots with another person to strategically move in with another reader. So this reader worked in cahoots with another person to strategically move in with another reader. So for some, you could be the other reader they strategically moved in with. For some... Maybe not. You have to plug yourself in where you fit. But this reader, comic reader, obviously, because if you're a true reader with true gifts, talents, skills, and abilities, you wouldn't be worrying about what other people do in their homes. You wouldn't be worrying about what they're doing with their business unless you like to provide their services. Um, you wouldn't be worrying what's going on inside their home is what I'm trying to say. This reader is. So they're a karmic reader, masculine or femme, but they work strategically with another person to for the other person to get into that other reader's home. So for some, you could be the reader where they moved into your home strategically. So the other reader could get gain information and have this other person that was living with you case out your home and survey what's going on in your home and get back to this reader. But I heard that's about to blow up in this reader's face because other Many other people know this reader was in cahoots with this person to do this. And so it's basically about to blow up on this reader in a negative sense because people know this reader was in co collab and cahoots with this person to get into your home reader to strategically case what's going on in your home and what you're doing in your home. That's crazy as fuck. That person needs mental health evaluation. And I'm just being for real. That's sick. It's about to blow up on them in a huge way. It's about to blow up on them in a huge way. Well, it should, because that's some sick shit, and that's just the truth. Let me see if I hear anything else. An Aquarius and a Sagittarius and a Libra hate your readings. You're a fire sign fem reader. An Aquarius, a Libra, and a Sagittarius hate your readings. You're a fire sign fem reader. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so what, man? An Aquarius, a Libra, and a Sag. They can be masculine fem Aquarius, masculine fem Libra, masculine fem Sag. They could have Aquarius, Libra, or Sag, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, and Hammer, Jupiter, Charts, and a Scorpio, and a Scorpio. <laughs> Aquarius, Libra, Sag, Scorpio. They could have Aquarius, Li Libra, Sag, Scorpio, um, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, and Hammer, Jupiter, Charts. They hate your readings. Now, of course, Fire Sign Reader, Aries, Leo, Sag, Reader, whoever you are, I don't think every Aquarius, Libra, Sag, or Scorpio hates your readings. I just think certain ones do. And for some of these people, it might be that karmic ass reader that was, if you resonate with the person that was recently living with you, and they were basically living with you and cahooting with the karmic reader to case out your space and your area for the karmic reader's personal gain, it could be these assholes. But you plug it in how it resonates. Aquarius, Scorpio, Libra, Sag, whatever. 
All right, I'm done. I love you guys so much. Everybody have a good day. Namaste.